still thick. Nah. We're gonna be snorkeling along Lehigh today. I'm actually up in uh, Northampton, Pennsylvania right now. Um, I'm actually near the falls. Uh, you can't see the falls because we're on the opposite side that they actually go down. So it's more like a dam. There's the pump house, bridge. I'm not gonna be going down this way though because uh, I don't want cops getting on me for uh, swimming where I'm not supposed to swim and all that. So I'm heading this way. And we're gonna see what's good in the water and all that. So, uh, other than that, that's all I got to say. Let's get to it. This thing's been in the river for a long time, but it's unopened. It's a Samuel Adams. Ah, oh, damn. That's right, yeah, you need to pop these off with a bottle opener. I might attempt to drink this. I might. It's, it looks like it's been in the river for a while, so.
Didn't stick. That sucks. All right, so this is what I found today. Uh, one really old bottle. I don't think it's an old bottle, but a, a liquid Aloha. I guess it's a. Uh, some kind of soda maybe a spanish soda a samuel adams beer unopened unopened i'm gonna see if i can pop the top off of that i got some cans of course Stuff out here. oh look at all the little bugs and guys that live here look at this guy flying around He's like, yo, man, you took my home. Can I got this out of the river, you know, I don't want to get nobody getting caught up in this. A bone. Is it human? I don't know. It's probably an animal. Shell. My most interesting find today has to be this rock. Now, I don't know if you guys can see this, but there's like these shiny rocks, like right there, all over it. You know, it, it could be sand, you know, river sand, but I was told that wherever there's quartz, there may be gold. It doesn't look like there's gold on this, but it's definitely holding my curiosity. So this is coming home with me and I'm going to inspect this some more, but this is my most interesting find today. That would be really cool if there's gold on here, but I highly doubt it, but that's pretty much it. I'm going to see if I can crack that beer, yo, let me see if I can go find a utensil in my book bag or something like that. Okay, so I need your help identifying whether this is silver ore or not you know you it gets real sparkly like especially right there this is a piece of quartz that i found in the river during the video you know right there you, you can see it sparkles right there's some more there there's a bunch on the back here. It's all sparkly. Especially in the middle right there. No, no, you tell me. I'm hoping I come across somebody with some uh, uh, rock. I don't know, rock experience. People who know rocks. You know, if it's pyrite or it's silver or... I don't know. Yo, if you can, give me a heads up. I'm, I'm going to keep this. I think it might be silver, but... We ran it past the metal detector. It was coming up to 65, 70, 85. And then it went back to that down to like 10. It, it was all over the place, but it was coming up as metal and all that. But I don't know, yo, you tell me, all right? Okay. If this thing doesn't hiss, I'm not drinking. <laughs> Maybe I'll take a sip, who knows? 
Oh, yo, it just hissed. I don't know if you heard that. Okay. Smells fine. Let's get some of the river crud off of it, man. Ah, yo, wish me luck. That's not bad. There's nothing wrong with it. It actually tastes like it's beer, man. It's beer. One more, yo. I don't drink like that. Well, sometimes. Yeah, that's good. It, wow. Aged in the river, baby, all day. Tastes great. It's even warm, man. It tastes a good warm. What the hell's going on here? It's not German beer, man. It's Samuel Adams, so. All right, well, if you enjoyed the video, my name's Stilfin, all caps, one word. Thank you for watching.